Hello, hello, hello. All right, you guys. So I know that I have been MIA this past week, but I want to let you guys know what I have been up to. So kind of in my area, and I, when I say in my area, I mean within two hours of my home, we had quite a few remodels to go. So we went to pretty much all of them, and we were in this one particular store, and we were able to grab like 600 plus items you guys as you can see we had trash bags we had buggies full of items we had a great time that day all of the penny shoppers there were extremely nice and it was only like um maybe like seven of us there in total so it was a really awesome day then on the next day we went to another store that was about two hours away from that original store we was in and you guys, we were able to grab another 379 items. I could not believe we were able to find that many items on the day after. That hardly ever happens. You might find, uh, you know, 50, 60 items or so, but another 379, that never ever happened. So we were extremely excited. So needless to say, after all of this remodeling and penny shopping that I have been doing, I had way too many items in my house, even after we had donated some and gotten all the items that we wanted. So we decided to have a garage sale to get rid of the rest of the items. Now, I know this is a big controversy kind of between the penny shoppers whether you donate all or you have Roman sales or you have garage sales but listen let me this is the second garage sale that we have done and I had so many people from the first one tell me that they were so blessed from us doing this garage sale that I decided to do it again now I want to tell you guys when I do a garage sale I'm not trying to get rich by any means at all all of our prices are between a quarter and two dollars for the most part we might have had a handful of items that were three dollars and four dollars but for the most part everything you see was priced at either a quarter 50 cents 75 cents a dollar quarter a dollar 50 cents and two dollars we were just trying to get rid of everything out of the house not to have all of these items in the house and plus be a blessing to our community because we had so many people to tell us how this helped them out so very much um, from trying to just make the dollars stretch now we live in a really small town so there are only two dollar generals in our in our immediate town so to get good penny hauls and to go to good remodels most of the time we have to travel sometimes up to two hours um in these particular ones in the video at the beginning that you saw we traveled an hour one way from my house and then also an hour another way from my house and actually we went to a third one that wasn't in the in the beginning we traveled another hour so we traveled three hours on um different occasions to go to these remodels so yeah it took a it takes a lot of gas you guys to do these so pretty much i'm just trying to get most of the time get my gas money back I'm going to them and just help my community out because I know how expensive everything is right now and not everybody has the time or the means to be able to travel an hour an hour and a half two hours to go to the remodels and do the penny shopping and I completely understand that so that is why we decided to do the garage sale and that is why I'm putting this video out here to you guys that if you are a penny shopper and if you are a remodeler consider doing a garage sale or if you want to donate it all or if you want to keep it all it's completely up to you but consider maybe doing a garage sale in order to make a little bit of gas money to help yourself be able to continue to do the penny shopping and the remodeling and trust me i promise you your community will love it um my community was ecstatic about this garage sale i'm going to tell you guys we started the garage sale at seven o'clock on a friday morning 
And at seven o'clock, I had 15 people lined up in front of my garage waiting to get in. So they were very appreciative and very excited about coming to shop the sale. And I was very appreciative and very excited to be able to get rid of some of the items and also be able to make some gas money back in order to keep doing it. Because like I said, it's taken a lot of gas money, especially right now with the gas prices being as high as they are. But that's pretty much all that I have you guys for this video. I just wanted to let you guys know where I what I've been up to and where I've been. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button, click that notification bell that way you'll be notified every time that I upload a video. Catch you guys later.